So now that we can climb our ladder or basically we can start flying around when we are at our ladder, we will need to be able to let go of our ladder again so that the player actually falls off when he either exits the ladder or when we press the E button. So first of all, let's make sure that we can press the E button to fall off the ladder. So here on our use, um, we will have to make a pool called uh, on ladder. Let's call it that. So on ladder is equal to on ladder here. So when we click the use function uh, or we call the use function, we will actually make sure that we indicate if we are going to gonna go on the ladder or not here. Um, or basically, actually we wanna do like this. We wanna, sorry, we wanna do like this. We are going to make a private function called use ladder. And then we are going to move the functionality from here to here and then we are going to say pull uh, on ladder and use that one so now we have a use ladder function down here in the bottom and we are going to call the use depending on if the player is on the ladder or not so inside our use function we'll have to make an if statement so if our player dot instance dot on ladder. So if our player is on ladder, we need to stop climbing because he's already on the ladder. So we need to drop off the ladder. Else we need to start climbing. So up here, we will have to say use ladder um, false because we, we need to stop climbing. Down here, we'll have to say use ladder true. So first time our player walks onto the ladder, he calls the use function. Then it takes, well, are we on the ladder? Well, we're not on the ladder. So we are going to execute the else statement and use the ladder and set on ladder to true. When we are on the ladder and we click the E button again, it goes in here and says, well, is the player on the ladder? He is on the ladder. Then we use the ladder again with false so that we jump off the ladder instead. So if we save this and go in here, we click the E button and we can fly up. And if I click the E button again, he falls off the ladder, as you can see. But there's also a problem here. You can see when I don't touch anything, he moves slowly downwards. And that's because the gravity is still on him. So it pulls him towards the ground. So we'll have to say, uh, jump in here and we'll also have to add a gravity scale so we can make a new um, integer called gravity there's gravity um, and then we can say player dot instance dot my rigid body dot gravity scale equals gravity there we go so now we are setting our gravity. So it's going to complain up here and tell you that you are not adding a gravity. If we need to stop climbing, our gravity needs to be one. If we need to start climbing, our gravity needs to be zero. So if we save this and go back in here, click the E button, fly up, then you'll see it's not moving downwards anymore because our gravity is off. When we click the E button, the gravity is back on and he falls down. So now we have some functionality where we can climb kinder up and down the ladder, but nothing is stopping us for flying off the ladder and just having like fly mode on here. So we need to do something about that. So we can't just fly around here and do like this and then just fly up here and then kill the enemy if that's what we want to there we go. So let's figure out how to fix that. To fix that, we will have to jump back into the player script and in here, or not in the player script, in the ladder script, of course. And in here, we will have to add some uh, functionality for um, exiting the ladder uh, collision. So in the bottom here, make a private void on trigger exit 2D collider uh, 2D other. And if it's the player that exits this collider. We can say if other tag equals player. So if it is the player, in fact, that exits the ladder's collider, well, then we simply have to use ladder. 
and call well on the ladder falls gravity one so this makes us jump off the ladder so if we save this and jump back into unity and run the game again then we can try jump onto the ladder now we can fly up and down if we go out here then we can't fly anymore so we can fly up the ladder we can fly down the ladder but if we go off the ladder then we can't fly so we're getting closer to having the uh, the correct functionality here and um, the next thing i would like to look at is the fact that you can go up the ladder go off the ladder here jump off it and then we land on the platform and if i try to fly on the ladder again i'm not able to go down through the platform so we'll have to do something so that we can pass through the platform from the top down when we are using the ladder so to do this we will have to jump back to the ladder script inside the script we will have to make a reference to the platform um, so that we can ignore the collision with it from the player so first of all in the top of the script we'll have to make a private collider 2d and call it platform collider so every single ladder will need a reference to the platform it's going to so serialize field so that we can set it from the inspector it makes it way easier if we can do that and then we will have to go to our uh, else statement here so when we need to start climbing we will have to ignore the collision with the player and the collider so we can say physics 2d dot ignore collision and the first collider is player dot instance uh, dot get component collider 2d and the other one is a platform collider and ignore the collision that's true because we need to ignore the collision between the two objects and then you can take this line of code and copy it basically um, besides that we will also need to ignore the collision when we exit it because if we jump off the ladder well then we also need to stop um, ignoring the collision or we need to we don't need to ignore the collision when we exit we need to stop ignoring the collision when we exit it that's what I'm trying to say so here on the line after we use the ladder in the on trigger exit we'll have to uh, stop ignoring the collision between the platform collider and the player so we set this one to false there we go and I think that's it for this one yeah so if we save this and go into unity and play the game now you'll see that we can jump onto the ladder and go up there are some bugs we still haven't fixed the jump and we can land we can walk around up here and we can jump on the ladder and see and go through it okay i can't go through it because i forgot to put the collider on the ladder um, so we need to open world find the medium platform select the ladder and then you'll see on the ladder script there's a platform collider here so we have to take the medium um, platform here and drag it onto this spot so now I have a reference to the collider it needs to ignore so let's try one more time the player go there go up jump off the ladder we can walk around up here and we can use the ladder again and now we can go down through the platform so everything works we are ignoring the collision on the platform here when we go up and exit the ladder we stop ignoring it and we land on the platform so now we can't go through it and right away when we use it again we will start ignoring the collision again so as you can see here when i go up the ladder i can go way too high up before i jump off it so we actually need to make the ladders collider a little smaller so i would like to put the collider down here instead of all the way up here so if you select the ladder and take the size the y size and and decrease it a little so that it just goes to over the edge of the platform then if you play the game again then it should look better so you jump off the ladder way earlier so you don't end up here when you jump off and the enemy can see you and everything and it still works so that you can go up and down uh, the ladder here there we go okay so i think that's it for this video um, in the next video we will be adding animation to the player so that when we use this he will start playing his climb animation and climb up and down uh, the ladder here it, it's going to look way better than just him idling on the ladder or jumping on the ladder like this
Um, so thanks for watching this video. Um, remember to like my Facebook page, follow me on Twitter and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it. Also remember to share the videos if you haven't done it already. And if you want to support me, you can also do that by clicking the link in the top of the screen here. Um, you can support me on Patreon and get some different perks like all my, my video, uh, all my um, projects. And or you can click the bottom link to get uh, this specific project or any of my other projects.